Hey you folks, Quilly Teen here, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Crusader Kings 2 as the Republic of Venice, and we are a new doge. We are Benedetto the First of Venice. We are 65 years old. We are not married. We are a widower. And we don't even have any kids. Wow. I did not get a whole lot done. We are also way over the domain limit, so uh, we're going to first, just to get some stats, we're going to see if we can't get ourselves a wife of some kind. Our intrigue sucks. So let's um, let's sort by that just to see what could happen here. Um, hmm, Maria Ziani? It's not, I don't know if that would be a bad thing, to be honest. Um, and she does have some pretty fantastic stats. She doesn't like me overly much. Now, ideally, someone with, you know, intrigue you want as much as possible. But that's, I mean, that's not terrible. We can, you know, we're going to get a little bit better once we're married. And, I don't know, the short reign might never go away. We're not, uh, we're a little old, so we might run out of that. Um, hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. That's a decent amount of stats, actually. Although, this, this does seem like the better set. I think we're going to see if we can't marry Giovanna. Get some inter-great house marriages going on. Boom. Like that. Now, the other thing is... Well, there's a few things. Children lacks a guardian. Oh, it's Mario! Yeah, um... I guess we'll educate him ourselves so that we can make choices, even though we're not, you know, we're not great at most things. So that's unfortunate, but we'll see if we can still guide his education a little bit. Uh, we've got some weak claims we can press. Our domain is too big, yeah. Well, we'll do something about that. And we've got ducal claims to do. So, find characters. We are going to um, look for men who are not in prison, who are not rulers. Um, this matters a little less, actually, because we're at this point we're going to be sorting by dynasty and just staying with the Contarinis. We're going to find some people. Um, Sinuceo is our spy master, so I'd like to keep him around if I could. Um, it'd be nice to start giving uh, Mario some prestige, but he is... Uh, I, I still want to keep training him up, so... Um, is there someone else who's, like, half-decent? We've got a dwarf. Um, he's strong and humble at age two. Interesting. He might be a decent person for us to educate later on. Um, really? I can, I can do that right away? As I say, he's, yeah, I was pretty sure he was too young. Um, we've already given something to all of the adults. I guess what we'll do is just like ship it off to people that I don't know oh god it's 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 annoying because I really want to be able to raise my next heirs but I would also like to give them prestige since that's not going to happen I guess we'll just use people in my house that are not incompetent and things I don't know or maybe maybe we should ideally someone with a decent relation why is ours so bad at least German is going to be part of it You know what? Screw it. Let's give the two-year-old the title. Where's that? Right there? I don't think it's got meaningful lower title titles, but we'll do that. Oh, we can give someone the entire Republic, too. Yeah, we're a Republic. That is weird. Yeah, so it's another kingdom. Which we still have. Like, we have that title. Alright, let's, let's take a look at this. Or no, the republics are duchies. Grand cities are counties? Yes, okay. So, we could safely give someone the Republic of Sicily. Although, um, two duchies is pretty optimal. Yeah, and we have, we have three. So, actually, we should give one away. Uh, we have to give it to someone who's already a ruler, though. So, let's flip this. Because we have the penalty right now for too many... Um, if I look at a random person. Do we have too many duchies? Yeah. So, I mean, and we can keep it. It's not the end of the world. But I think I'm going to give it away just because um, it will help... Um, it will help our relations. 
and why not? We'll have to pick someone who likes us a fair amount and hopefully has, ideally has just a single holding. And we don't even care where they have it. It's kind of their own problem if they don't have the right one. They can sort of spar with each other. See, so he's only got a single city. So that's fine. We can, we'll grant a title. Oh, it's a city, not a grand city. Uh -huh. Right, mayor, baron, count. He hates me though, so that's not good. I think Lord Mayor would be okay. Like that. I think this is all right. I don't think I'm screwing anything up. I guess we're going to find out together. Boom. All right, still part of Venice. Everything is awesome that way. Good. Now, we still need to... I guess we're going to have to give away some of these grand cities. Make someone in some counts, which is fine. Um, so, back to not a ruler. A Contarini that doesn't really matter. Like, this son, who's weak, I, I you know... Ah, such a duality. Dwarf and Slothful? At least we're going to take the ones who at least like semi-like us. Majorca is over there. I guess we could probably do that. Sucks to have such a crappy stewardship still. This is it's gonna be fine. It's gonna it's not the end of the world. Okay. Good. So we're back there. And other than that, we're just gonna continue the war. Um keep things going. We have tons of money. Holy crap, we were loaded. We were absolutely stinking rich, so we could get some more mercenaries. I know I'm still in slow speed, but I'm still trying to sort of evaluate things. Um, we could get more mercs. I don't think we need to right now. Hey, we got married. We can get craptastic amounts of gold. Or a little bit of prestige. I'm going to go for the prestige, because I actually don't have very much. It's surprising that I got elected. Yeah, we're going to press a few of these. So, taking a look here. Let's do a few more upgrades. Just one more. Again, I'd like to stay above 500 comfortably. Okay, let's speed things up a little bit. Nice victory here. Chase these guys over to here. Who's running my... Yeah, it'd be nice actually to not lose Sunu Cho, my, um, my spy master. So let's do a replacement. Since I've already lost my king, I'm reigning at least, which is good. Let's just do that. Uh, retinues, we are capped out, which is perfect. That's where we want to be. We still got the ships up, so some people are kind of cranky. Although, oh, the crankiness resets. Hold on a sec. I just realized the truce is reset. Yeah, all right, we lost our claim as well. But more importantly, the truce is reset, which is really good because we can go to war with Pisa again. Next time that comes up, I gotta really just assassinate the other guy. Yay, successful crusade that we didn't really help for, so I'm not really interested. Like, listen, I got my own battles. I don't care about your religious differences that badly. I got Falieros to kill. Oh. We got a ton more troops all of a sudden. Bring the ships back. Raise some mercs. Boom. Mario! It's a me! Uh, trusting soul. Mmm, no, I don't like that. I think envious would be better. Just 
kind doesn't fit for us. Huh, <laughs> tender soul. I'll give him a tender back. Uh, looks like he just got nothing. Hmm. Come on. Select. Get on a boat. Go over here. Hopefully that siege can hold out for a while. Hmm, not that long. Okay, I don't want... This, these are way too close. Okay, let's shave off some of these guys. Basically, we're just going to leave the mercs behind. Take all the retinues. Which is not that much. But I want to combine them and then go after these guys. Ugh. Come on, walk faster. Jeez. Oh, really? You're coming this way? Okay. Oh, there's not really any benefit for Flatland. Oh, and I didn't even check the ruler status. Anyway, you smash this. I know we're going to lose some people. Okay, well, looks like we're going to win that. Okay, we're going to be fine. You really going to Nice? All right, that works out. Right, ninety-eight percent. Come on. So he still think he's got an army, so he still thinks he can win. But that's going to change in two seconds. Plus, I guess he's got the one property that. That's fine. Easily crushed. He's even got the train penalty there now. we lose a percent? Arg. Merchant ports are all being completed. We don't have a ton of money. Are we... Oh, are we even losing money per turn? It's possible. And that would be really, really unpleasant. Let's rush these guys over here and let's just rush this siege. Yeah, we're losing money. Okay. Double Merc, kind of expensive. Um, also, we can slow down the reinforcement. There we go. Finally, peace treaty. Accept. Boom. Boom. Now the question becomes, do we disband some mercs? Okay, if I stop my retinues from refilling altogether, am I going to start making money? It looks like yes, which is good. Okay, load everyone up. We're going to war against Pisa. For something. I don't know what the target will be yet. Do I really not have enough room on the boat for everything? Ugh, that is so annoying. Yeah, we'll claim the whole county. Oh, it's the claims. Push someone else's claim. What I gotta do is give him a title. So that he's one of my vassals. There we go. You're going to get this city here. Good. Now, if I claim this, he's a proper, proper vassal of mine now. I think this should work. Oh, there's a county claim that we could do there too, but there are many trading posts we can attempt to seize as well, but no. I'm gonna go this route. I think this is the best for what we want to do. Good, we're gonna land on Pisa instantly to stop any Merc reinforcements from having any effect whatsoever. And we're gonna keep someone camp there the whole time.
And of course, take the actual province we're in interested in. Good. Meanwhile, we will probably disband these ships. Boom. Alright. Easy sieges. I guess they're halfway. Just finish them the old-fashioned way. That's fine. That is a large army. Finish that quick. Come over here. Join forces. And split up. No. Just a small group. Whoa, it's Serene Doge. Why am I leading an army? Oh no, it's the retinue of. Alright, that's fine. Really? You're 66. What a little pervert. Smash this. And the next one. And then we can attack these guys. Oh, and the next one. We're going to lose that, but that's okay. Oh, and the trading post. Not that it gives much war score, because they're so easy to crush. Where'd the rest of his army go? Hello. 25 gold. We're going to hold on for a sec. Oh, there it goes. Let's follow it. Mario asks, if a tree falls in the woods and there's no one here there to hear it, does it make a noise? Good question. You should ponder on your own. Uh, shy is not good. We don't want that. Diligent is excellent. Arbitrary is less so, but hopefully diligent. Yes. Oh, this guy. This guy's going to be great. And he's got a decent claim on something. All right, let's keep chasing these guys down. Oh, what? Army of Grandmaster Saladin. This is a holy order? That's why it's not fighting me? Yeah, that explains a few things. So that was a waste of, like, moving around a little bit. Money's still good? Money's great. Okay, more sieging done. This is the, uh... Papal territory. Although he probably... I'm looking for the flashing border. I thought he'd have some trading posts here. Is he really not? Ah, oh, there we are. I mean, he'll probably surrender soon enough, but we'll keep marching through here. Yeah, that I am so unconcerned with. Destroy all his siege po uh, siege trade posts, especially since I bet you he can't rebuild them. Oh, I guess this doesn't actually destroy them, now that I think about it. I doubt he has enough to actually siege. Oh, he does! That's interesting. Generic dude. Yeah, alright. Um, research tech. It's still green, so I guess that probably means it can still use it. And you, uh, you are going to uncover plots. 
in Venezia. Thank you very much. This guy seriously needs to surrender. It's very rude of him not to. Yeah, it's too bad taking over siege or uh, trade posts don't give war score. I mean, I know anymore or as much, but I think it's probably good from the balance point of view. It was just kind of ridiculous before, because they have they have no defenses, so you can just rip through them like they're not even there. I have a daughter, Alfonsina. All right, we're going to split off a group again. Small group. Although, well, not that small. Whoops. You know what, never mind. We're gonna do it this way after all. Okay. So we are gonna take you and send you there. And send you over here. I'm not scared of that because that's still just the holy army, so they shouldn't fight us. Oh, intrigue! What the hell, man? Let's God, we gotta murder someone. Next valley arrow in the line, right? Oh, right. Our skill sucks. Hopefully, we still have some friends who can assist and be useful here. Now, a lot of people might still not join us right now because I think we still have the uh, the short reign penalty. So... Yeah, this is going to be somewhat less than ideal. We've got a little bit of money. We could, like, bribe our spy master. I've been forgetting to do this. Yay! That is enough to bring him in, bring him on board. Anyone else? Like my wife. She has moral qualms. Hmm. Really? I guess I should look. I need someone who's pretty close. Your blood red relative, come on. No, oh, well, I guess we'll just have to take what we've got. Speed things up a little. Win a meaningless skirmish. What's the plot power at? 90%. It's not great. Oh. Alright, you know what? We're gonna let him rot for now, but we'll go ahead and we will... We'll go ahead and ransom him off. Who cares? We're nice and merciful, sometimes. God, like, you don't have to be a dick about it. I just let you out of prison. I mean, you had to pay, but not much. I think you'd be more appreciative. Okay, well, this will cause him to peace out pretty freaking fast. Well, he's at 100% now. Really? Listen, it, war's indecisive. It's because he's got these troops kicking around that... Oh. 
you have any trading posts around? Let's go back over here and burn some more trading posts. Doesn't give lots of war score, but it should annoy you at least. And that'll make me happy. It doesn't burn them though, and I wish it would. Although, I guess I don't want them to be able to burn it when they hit me. There we go, enforce demands. So, theoretically, yes, no, yes, it's part of Venice. Okay, I've done it right. Whoo hoo. So really, I could provoke the other guy's title or whatever, but no, I'll let him have it for now, it's fine. Ah, now that's the way to do it. He's at war? But if he wasn't, then, oh, I guess I gotta do it this way, don't I? Um, oh, he's in a holy war. Well, that would explain the, the holy orders and whatnot. Um, yeah, good. Okay, so we have many claims we could press as well all over the place. Where are these things? The Holy Roman Empire? No. In Danish. Holy Roman Empire. Where's this place? Kiev. Oh god, my geography. Uh, I'm looking for the blinking, looking for the blinking. Damn it, I suck. Um, Kiev. There it is. I don't think we're pressing any claims over there. That would be incredibly inconvenient. Puris. Where is this? Oh, there. Hmm. That is definitely doable. The fat of Barcelona. Barcelona's got here and here. We could definitely claim that. Um, still, I think it's another time to bring down our mercs and build more financial buildings. Let our, our money pool up a little and, and maneuver that. Because our true target is the the other um, the other republics, right? It would be nice to snag a little bit more land over here, though. I'm not going to lie. Although, is that even a claim that's worth... No. It's not even someone who's part of anything. No. Alright, never mind then. Um, definitely taking down the mercs, and I'm going to do it the safe way, which is over here. So, hired people, dismiss them. We have no levies. Oh, we have some fleet levies stuck somewhere, which is kind of awkward. We're gonna make sure that these are set to full reload. And the troops that are left on the table, or on the field, these are just my, um, my retinues, so they can just walk back slowly. We've got decisions. Yeah, use of our title, which we will definitely want to do when we get a chance. Yeah, they, because these guys are understandably upset. They've gotten like a couple of boats sitting around doing nothing for ages and ages and ages. Um, now, the ducal claims actually have a lot of value, and maybe we'll explore that next time. See you, folks.